So for some time our main inlet on our Adria caravan, um, the protective flap, the exterior flap has become brittle um, and it cracked last year and in recent times it's sort of, oh, there's a piece of plastic in there, um, yeah, so I've not been able to find a source to replace the flap, so what I've ended up doing is purchasing a new flush fitting mains inlet kit so we're gonna replace that with a new one so we got this from ebay um it was 12 pounds um so we'll open it up and have a look what's inside the packaging and see how easy it is to fit so open it up and no instructions. So I think it's going to be down to common sense. Um, so it's a little bit bright where I am I'm, uh, in, in my caravan. So that's um, the inside. So we've got the four screws out this in. So what we'll do now, get a screwdriver and just have a look what's inside uh, inside here. Okay, so there's the cover comes off that's where the screw went. Oops. Um, and when we take the other one off, we'll replicate the wiring. Uh, neutral, live, earth. Um, see how we get along with it. Alright, so I'm in the bottom of the Adria caravan, so that's the outside, and that's coming in the back here. Um, so we need to unscrew this from the outside. I'm going to take out this screw here, just so this flex can have a little bit longer. Um, I'm not really too sure why that's got gaffer tape on it, but we'll investigate that. So next, I'm going to undo this screw here, and then that'll give this um, a little bit of flex on there, I think. Go and have a look outside now. Yeah, so as you can see, this um, outer cover is just disintegrated. Right, I've now got two, three, four screws, and I'm hoping this is going to pull forward. So um, let's unscrew these. All right, so uh, I'm just going to put the camera down because it's a two-handed job this we can see it's oh that's completely shattered hasn't it you can see it's um pulling forward right so that's out all right i can see what's happened here looks like this back flap's not been put on right and i'm hoping that the new one is going to fit there otherwise i'm going to have a problem so uh yeah so this was just basically gaffer taped on and um right, there are connectors on this one so let's have a Look on the new one. Oh, so I did have a panic there for a moment. I couldn't find the earth. Anyway, there's the earth. Um, live, neutral here. So uh, brown, blue, neutral. Um, so I'll disconnect these old wires next. Oh, so that's everything disconnected outside. Sorry, you know, inside. So obviously that's live. This is not live. I'll pull the wire yeah. out. So lots of. Um, screws to undo to put the cable in so i'm going to undo all of those let's see good shout let's just make sure that fits oh i put the right way around yeah so that goes into the here all right let's have a look how we're going to put the um cable so there are if you look so a bit one-handed So this is coming in like this, so we can tap that through and put the cables in. Or we can bring the cables over the top here. So I think we're going to go through the back here. So I'll just pop that through. It's obviously different layouts, so you can use this thing. So that's just pops out there now. Okay. All right, so just so you get the idea now. So the cabling up through here, through, 
by Butel and Earth next, okay? So that's the heavy on there, that's the plate. Okay, right, so that's the neutral in here, tightened up, and I've just got the, sorry, neutral earth, neutral in here, so these are just tightening up, and another one there as well, and then we're going to put the live on, live on the other side. Right, so let's get this right, live, neutral, earth, okay, and everything is tight there. Alright, so it's tightening these up now here and here. So one point, uh, one point that's really important to remember is when you're securing this wire, you need to make sure that, that this is here. This is securing the outside wire, not the actual flex. So then you can see that there. That's all okay, yeah. So that's really important. That. So again, I'm a bit one-handed, so I can't actually video this. But can you see how that clips on there? I'm going to go on the back there now. Fit the cover on. Let's try that now. Right, so that's all on okay. Can you see here? So finally, I've got a screw to put in here. Then there's that little GoPro showing right, that. So that's all connected. So what I'm going to do now, before I screw this in, I'm actually going to connect the hookup cable to here and make sure the electrics are all working and nothing blows up. So let's, let's connect that. All right, so tight fit. Well, that's plugged in okay. Put into my van. Yay, we have electric. Okay, let's secure that back into the um, into this area here. So I was just going to point out that the old one had this um, rubber seal. There's no silicon on here. You see the seal? This is the old one. And see, so this has got the seal here, so there's no silicon going on here or anything. So I've now gone round with the four screws, making sure that the holes all line up, which they do do. And now basically, um, I'll now, oh, as you can see, tighten this unit up. Hey, yay. Yeah, all working fine. Um, let's plug the hookup cable in. There you go. So that's the new unit in at the back. So I need to go and put that um, cable tie in and screw that down next. Right, so that's all secured at the back. Like it was. Right, so there you are. There's a new one fixed on. As you can see, here's the old one. So that was pretty simple and it's literally a 10, maybe 15 minute job maximum. Uh, quite painless, uh, no issues. Um, so I hope you found that of uh, some use. If you did, do. It'd be great if you could give that a like. Help me subscribe. Um, sorry, help me increase my channel a little bit. Subscribe if you want to. And if you want a notification when I upload a video, Hit that notification bell. Belt? Belt. It's one of them days. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.